you will have seen, you know, you go from this very calm state of flow or the zone that you've, you've read so much about and probably experienced if you've been out on a long run or a bike ride or whatever. So you get this brilliant balance between the challenge that we think we've got in the environment and the coping skills that we believe we've got. And again, this is very different for each of us. But what we've seen during this pandemic and through different parts of, of elite sport is we start to get this elevated perception of the challenge uh, that's in the environment. So for me on that night in India, when I choked under pressure in front of that massive crowd, this felt like the biggest game of my life, the biggest you know day we'd ever had. This was the most important five minutes. And it was like the bowler was bowling hand grenades. Uh, and at the same time, um, in my own head, that voice was starting to chip away saying on the, on the coping skills, well, you've never played on this pitch before. You've never been here before. Uh, you've never won a game for England before from here. So why do you think you can do it now? And I suppose that, that sort of, you know, being out of balance there really started to affect my thinking. I then tried to get back to safety. And as you might know, safety is a place called the pavilion, which means you're not in the game anymore. So I was safe, uh, even though I just ran out Freddie Flintoff, perhaps not the safest place, but but my brain was trying to take me away from the judgment, take me away from the media, take me away from the spotlight. But actually, as, as leaders and as high performers, we need to be in that environment. We need to be in the center of the, the stage to be able to deliver our best game. So I suppose the, the thing to think about is what's the mindset that you're taking back into the workplace, into your uh, fitness arena, into your programs, into your gym? What, what are you going to be doing? Because that's going to create an environment, a psychological environment for your team. So we need to think about how we can preempt situations so we don't have all that novelty. We need to think how we can bring control back to our team and how they can start to get more confident. And then we can start to think about from our customer's point of view, what's their mindset coming into our facilities when we relaunch? You know, are they worried about the, the distancing? Are they worried about the, the hygiene? You know, we need to have some great posters and speak to them as they come in and just reassure them that everything is safe. We've, you know, not cut any corners and that we're there at their pace to, to give them a great experience and introduce them slowly because they will be feeling that the challenge that their experience is, is greater than their coping resources. And, and we need to rebalance that for sure in their head.